Eno ye, open up television. Enjoy the uniqueness. Come, baby. Just come. <laughs> you know what? I'm not the new director here. I'm going to spoil you. Oh this is dollars. Come on, hug me. Hug me. Director! Director! Who's going on? Somebody help me! Who's going on? Director! Director! Oh. Oh. director. Made the new director of my organization. Wow! Wow! Congratulations! That is huge! You were made the director. Your organization is big. Small you. Hey, made the director. This is you. This is not even double promotion. This is like triple promotion because ah wow! How did it happen? I don't know, but still there's a problem. It's a problem for me. Problem? Yes. What's the problem? Everyone that has been called to this position declined the offer. Why? The, the, uh, this is a juicy position. Because the other directors that go to this level, they all died mysteriously. Because for the past two years, the organization has promoted three persons to that office and they all died mysteriously. The first guy was hit by stroke and died mysteriously. The second guy slept and did not wake up. The third guy just slumped on his seat and died. In two years? In two years. Pastor, I am so scared. I, I feel like a scapegoat. I, I just feel like it. <laughs> Honestly, I don't feel the same way for you. Let me tell you something. The reason why God made us light is so that we can shine in darkness. I feel weary. I honestly feel like giving up. I want to give up this position. Listen, there is prophecy over your head. You cannot give up now. I can assure you, this is the reason God brought you to the organization. To bring deliverance. Who else is best for this job other than you? We are the light of the world. Darkness must give way for our light. My daughter, you cannot give up now. We march into territories and dominate. That is our identity because we're in Christ. Congratulations again. Congratulations. I cannot give up. So proud of you. Congratulations. I cannot fail. Jesus! is a bastard. Don't be performed against me shall prosper. <laughs> hey, Jesus, Jesus, Jesus. The prophecy over my life must be fulfilled. God, I will not die but live in the name of Jesus. 
plans of the wicked over my life shall not stand. No evil shall be for me, shall be for my household. In the name of Jesus, it doesn't matter their plans, it scatters. In the name of Jesus, hey, no enchantment or divination can stand against me. I don't care what happened to the others, but none shall come near my dwelling. In the name of Jesus. Charms. Yes, and it, it feels like at night strange beings come into my room to press me. Pastor, the attack over my life is fierce. It's really fierce. Oh God. I can assure you they cannot do you anything. Your enemies will submit. I need you to pray more. Tonight you will pray. Let me give you a scripture to pray with. Psalm 81 verse 14, Amplified Translation. It says, Then I would quickly subdue and humble their enemies and turn my hands against their adversaries. You are going to pray tonight that God will quickly subdue your enemies and turn your hands against your adversaries. That will be your prayer. And you see the mighty hands of God. Your deliverance is near. Is near. Let us pray. Redo Shabakata Yada De Brakata Yada Badaba. Dear Lord Jesus, oh God, show yourself strong in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. or manager that I can find in any company I'm attached to. That's why I became a cleaner here. And this is not the first company. I use my demonic powers to kill them. So you were the one masterminding all the killings? Yes, madam. It has been me. I even thought it was top management, but Honestly. I didn't know it how I cleaner. Who would have known this world is wicked? Hi! Very wicked. Madam, I've tried to kill you several times. But you are very powerful. I even visited your house in the realm of the spirits. But there was fire. I could not penetrate. Fire almost drives me how to escape. <laughs> you get power. God save you. God really saved me. Me? My pastor told me that there is a prophecy over my life. And when the hand of God is upon a man's life, such a man's life is not killing. John, Ma? we have to escalate this matter. But well, listen, my dear, in the meantime, you have to surrender your life to Jesus Christ. Hi, guys. 
I am Grace. I present to you Open Up TV Uganda. This is an online TV channel that organizes different types of programs, talk shows, entertaining films. Please watch, subscribe, and share all the videos that you find. Check it out, Open Up TV Uganda. Enjoy the uniqueness.